Yes, hello, everybody. It's Let Me Have Finisher, and today, of course, is Thursday morning. It is the kitchen day. It's the fourth. Michelle gets her hair done today. I wanted to try to get a video in. I didn't. We didn't do one at home. Um, actually, we did try to get two videos in and uh, at home in the studio and during the shoots nowadays. It's just that we kind of got video graphers block, and we kind of just kind of went all over the place, and we're skidding around, and we ran, and we hit a tree. <laughs> <laughs> I mean by that is, not that we literally hit a tree, but um, it was just that we couldn't seem to get the pieces to gel, and when we get into that situation where, you know, it's kind of like the Cialis commercial, you know, you want to be ready for when the moment's right, and that's why we had the phone with us, because we know that sooner or later, I would, me and Michelle were going to come up with a new video topic, and we're going to just kind of land on something. Um, I'm not going to take too much time to rehash everything that I talked in Michelle's video, because um, that would be kind of time-consuming. By the way, coming up on February 11th, 2015, I will officially be 180 years old. That's right. 180 years old. Born in 1835. This is the life I usually choose to remember the most of all because it was the most happy life for me. 1835 died on March 11th, 1910. And then, of course, I had a few lives after that. And then I came back enjoyed Michelle. We actually got together uh, originally as her spirit guide when she was born on February 13th, 1968. It was a part of an agreement that we had signed off with Mother Asna and then Michelle and I officially reunited as one body around, believe it or not, Michelle, I think you kind of forgot this, around February 11th, 2011. How oh, interesting that was that we went um, to merge on the birth, the official birthday of my life. Um, that was that was a great time for both of us, and we've been together since. And um, it's been a wonderful time for me and Michelle. And we've gotten together pretty good. And um, well, we might sometimes joke around about Michelle's weight and all that, but let's be honest here: um, Michelle and I uh, do have. A weight issue. It's this body is like a lot of people on disabilities, very sedentary. It sits around a lot, and of course, it makes our weight explode. And it's not helping us either way. However, um, we have also made some bad decisions, which we have to be honest about. Um, bad eating habits, you know, stress. And getting all these videos down to you is a stress. It is usually a fairly good stress. Um, but it is time consuming. And we, I make an effort, Michelle makes an effort to cover topics of all types and things like that. And, um, yesterday Michelle didn't do any video except she edited some of the videos that we did earlier. And then she just got frustrated. And we're just gonna bend the suckers because uh, we think that the the quality was just just not in there. Um, I mean, the video technical part excellence is there, but it's just um, the uh, the videos are just not that exciting. So um, we're gonna just go ahead and bend those and then get some new ones in. Michelle is gonna be buying her uh, her violin in March, and as far as a cell phone, well. Old cell phone, actually. Refurbished cell phone. Yeah, that's going to probably be in the month of April. Michelle already has a lead to give her old phone, which I'm using for this video, to somebody else for $10. Considering it's over four years old, and it certainly has seen a lot of use. It still physically holds its own, and it's a good phone overall. Um, Michelle wants to get herself an iPhone for us with... 32 gigabytes of RAM on it, dual processor and phone. I think it's going to suck power like a vacuum cleaner, but oh well, we'll find out. Um, the, speaking of um, iOS, as I understand it, Michelle, this is more of Michelle's thing than mine. Um, the newest version of iOS that's out is buggy, dodgy. Power second, um, frustrating, annoying, 
and just not worth it. Oh yeah, unfortunately it can also destroy your Wi-Fi connection in your phone on certain phones such as the 4S. So Michelle is definitely not sure if she wants to go with that um, technology and I can't particularly blame her right now since she's already lamented the loss of iOS 5.3. Was it 5.3, 5 5.2, 5. 5. something like that, or whatever. I'm Michelle knows this better than I do. I'm not the technical person. Um, anyway, so for the time being, I want to let you know that yes, that way you can hear the soup kitchen is open tonight, and yes, I have other people here uh, with me as I talk, introduce you to one of them, which you have seen before in. Uh, with me and Michelle, and we're doing a video with him, and then Michael Vitale, I'm not going to uh, reintroduce you to him, because I don't know if he wants to be in the video or not. Want to be in the video? Um, <laughs> but I appreciate you. Okay, that's what I thought. It says you're already in the other video with Michelle anyway. Videos, huh? How many videos have you made now? Uh, we make about... Um, a day, we make about three. So, when you started until now, you probably have like 3,000 videos? Well, they're not quite 3,000, it says it's on the average, it's about three videos a day. And we've been doing, um, we got about 500 videos, on Mich uh, 500 plus videos on Michelle's channel, about 50 videos on my channel, plus Michelle's talking with her world channel, she has about... 10 videos there. Plus, she has a radio program on uh, yourlisten.com. So, between all the sources, we're very active in the communication industry. Let me just try to get a bit, see if we can try to show him briefly. So, you know, I'm talking about disembodied voice. Um, this is Michael right here in the corner. Uh, you can see he's saying hi to you. And, of course, I'm here. And, so he's actually got the microphone pointed at him right now, whereas the microphone is is a 90 degree angle for me. So um, you might hear him better than me. But wait, anyway, that's basically the way it works. And um, when you got the iPhone for video. Um, by the way, Mrs. K Kim Kristofferson, the Kardashian, says she says, "Oh, to do a selfie, I do 300 selfies, and then I pick one that's the best." Well, Michelle doesn't do no 300 freaking selfies. Um, usually, Michelle does live video streams, which means she gets one try to get it right. Likewise with me, sometimes we'll reshoot, sometimes we don't. We're not gonna reshoot all the time. It's just too much of a pain. Um, we like to go live. We like to have give you the, the live feed. And um, that's one thing I think we should consider um, is in the future is uh, getting it so that we can do more live video streams. What do you think, Michelle? Um, you know, I think, honestly, well, then, you know, if we do get the iPhone 4S, we're going to have a camera on the front of the phone as well as on the back of the phone. So we would be able to do self um, videos easier using Google Hangouts. But then we have to upgrade the iOS, too. Yeah, but that's something we'll talk about in the future. Right. So, definitely, you might want to consider the future time. Well, now that they come out with iOS 7, um, I have to be careful because the um, I'm up to iOS 8. And uh, there's issues about that and certain software programs can cause problems with my iPhone iTunes. Yeah, definitely. That's one of the reasons why Michelle never went with an iPhone 6 or 6 Plus, even if she could finance it. It won't integrate, it will not plug into my iTunes, so I won't be able to uh, do things. Right. Okay, well, thanks. Okay, welcome. Anyway, so I wanted to say is to everybody, just like Michelle does, is that we would love to hear from you. If you have ideas, comments, suggestions, complaints, gripes, kudos, whatever, you can place them in the comments section below here. And, or you can send me a private email to L-U-M-I-F-I-N-I-S-T-R-A at gmail.com. And I will look at them, read them, review them. And if it's a great suggestion, I will attempt to... Um, do 
So if there are complaints, I will read them. I will do my best to keep an open ear at all times. Because I know you guys got a lot to say, and I know that people have a lot to do. And, of course, me and Michelle will be going to get our hair done tonight. And then tomorrow, the soup kitchen will hopefully be open again. And we will be here. And, of course, I mean, it's kind of sucks we don't have any data on the phone right now because then we can't go ahead and upload the videos. Either he could upload them low at the speed that we got. It's kind of ridiculous. Yeah, absolutely. All right, so we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye, everybody. Have a nice day.